Okay, that was weird. Welcome back to another episode of Kayla in the Kitchen, Cooking with Kayla. I'm your host, Kayla, and you are in my kitchen. So, okay, so today we're gonna be making a super easy, super simple, super simple, super easy, another like three ingredient recipe, cacao, cacao, pepe. How do you say that shit? Okay, so I went and looked it up. It's cacao pepe. Literally, it's just Parmesan, pasta water, pepper. But me, being who I am, I'm going to throw in what? Red pepper flakes, because why? I put that shit in everything. Now, so I'm gonna throw in some red pepper flakes, probably some garlic powder, and like some Italian seasoning just to, you know, throw the eggs some on me, you know what I'm saying? Cook your pasta al dente. Al dente just means like barely underdone you don't want none of that mushy ass pasta um salt your pasta water good people you got drained pasta pasta water pasta pasta water pasta pasta water you get it you're going to add some olive oil into a pan maybe like two tablespoons um and then you're going to get some pepper you want to make sure it's fresh ground Literally just grind it up in there. Whole bunch. Just grind it up. Whole bunch. You want a whole bunch. Like, seriously, a whole bunch. Once you got it good and hot, you want to be able to see the olive oil bubbling. The pepper is going to do, like, some crackling. Nice things next. Pour some pasta water. So once you got your pepper in there, olive oil, you add your pasta water, this is what it's gonna look like. Keep stirring, keep stirring, people. Now you're going to take your drained pasta and put it back into the mix. Now you're gonna let the pasta water reduce so that way your um, spaghetti is getting nice and coated in the pepper that you put in. Okay, so I added in some garlic, some Italian seasoning, more pepper and red pepper flakes. And now you're going to add in your Parmesan. And you gotta mix it up real good. Actually, I'm gonna add some more pasta water because it's starting to look you know, I want it to get dry. Add your Parmesan. You want a whole bunch of Parmesan? I have actually less Parmesan than I thought I had. So I'm gonna be using mozzarella to make it more cheesy. Probably not the best idea because mozzarella is super stringy, but that's what you get when you don't check your ingredients before you start cooking. You're probably gonna need like a cup, if not more. So this is what it looks like, super cheesy, super easy. <laughs> that rhymes, super cheesy, super easy. Seriously though. Time to taste. This is like, it's usually not supposed to be this cheesy, but like I said, mozzarella is super stringy. So let's get into it. Mm, oh, oh my gosh, bro. This is so fucking good. Seriously, this is so fucking good. And it literally... I mean, aside from cooking your pasta, it takes like 15 minutes. So good. 